Evo Morales may have fled Bolivia from Mexico, but his supporters are going nowhere. And some of them are in hospital after security forces in the city of Sacaba opened fire on a protest, injuring dozens and killing a number of people too. So this is what they call democracy, killing us like we're nothing. They're not numbers, they're lives. Where is the justice? For many indigenous Bolivians, the left-wing Morales is a hero. And the new interim president, Janine Añez, is a racist and a right-wing usurper. 40% of the country's population is indigenous, and at first the new cabinet did not include a single indigenous person. Añez has accused Morales of stoking tension from abroad, but her own focus is not entirely national. In a Skype call to Venezuelan opposition leader Juan Guaido, she wished him well in his efforts to bring down his own government. I think we have the same objective. I think there have been years of difficult struggle. We have tried to avoid at all costs this social convulsion because this is a citizen demand. Fresh presidential elections are being planned. But the United Nations has warned La Paz that the violence could spin out of control and ultimately undermine the country's democracy. <laughs>